Sagittarius, welcome. Welcome to Coral Tree Terra. Whoa! <laughs> On fire. I love that. Saggy, how are you? Um, this is going to be your um, love and, and work finance uh, reading for um, the week of uh, January the 10th through to the 17th, 2022. I hope you are well, Sagittarius. No matter where you are in the world, I hope you had a lovely Christmas break with your friends and family. Um, so we are going to see how your person is feeling, what are they thinking about, what actions they might be ta taking towards you, what are their intentions, what's, what's on their mind, what's in their heart, and a potential outcome. Um, Sagittarius, please uh, remember to, to only take what resonates. And um, the energies are reversed. I often read, uh, often, not often, but uh, the energies are fluid. So it can be your energy, it can be your person's energy. Roles can be reversed. Second week of January, January the 10th through the 17th. Saji, let's begin. Please, Tarot. Please, Spirit. How does this person feel about Sagittarius? How do they feel? Um, what are they thinking? Please, Tarot. Show me the energy surrounding Sagittarius person. How are they feeling? What are they thinking? What's in their heart? What's in their head? Okay. They are thinking. The Four of Swords, can you see this? <clears throat> Four of Swords. Nine of... Nine of Swords. Five of Wands. What's going on? And the Knight of um, Wands. They are thinking a lot. Sagittarius, a person is thinking a lot about something. They are worried about something. This instead of... They are worried. They would like to come and rescue this situation. Because this um, <clears throat> depiction here. Um, so your person is, is kind of taking the time to figure out how to rescue the situation, how to come in and, and do something. This is the um, Knight of Swords, I believe. And that means action, swift action. They're worried about something. What is it that they're worried about? There is five of wands here. So there is inner conflict or you have a lot of conflict with your person. There is something uns um, unspoken, I feel, maybe. Because the Four of Swords is usually the energy of someone who's who's not quite, um, yeah, who's not really saying how they feel. So your person, Saji, is um, very worried about some sort of conflict that may be between you. Knight of Wands, um, I feel they, they basically... <clears throat> I really strongly feel that um, here with the Knight of no, the Four of Swords and the Knight of Wands, they are really looking to find this courage, courage in and come in and like save the day, like save the situation, like um, whatever this conflict is about. We'll find out. Let us just 
a normal situation. I mean, there's two people, two ways of doing things, two, you know, two minds. It's, it's, there's no way we can agree with everyone and with our partner at all times. It's just not possible. So that is. So that is either conflict between you two, Saji, so you and your person, or your person feels that there is a conflict. They are not clearly talking about it yet. Let's find out. They would like to change that. They definitely are worried. Maybe someone wants to buy a motorbike. That was a joke, but that was a very loud. Um, sorry about that. The window is open here. Maybe someone is riding motorbikes. Or wants to. Because the Four of Swords is, is dreaming about themselves uh, sitting on a horse coming with something, yeah? I mean, we can change the vehicle, so... They want to save the day, they want to, um, they are taking the time to come and sort it out. Because it's very, it's, it's weighing them heavily, your person. Um, Saji. So what, um, please Tara, what is this conflict? Why Saji's person is worried? What is the, what is it that they're worried about? How is this person feeling? Tell me more, please. Tell me more, please. Tara, tell me more. Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, Eight of Wands. We got. Hmm. I don't sway away from energies like this, because th this is life, right? I see some readers have absolutely always gorgeous um, energies on the table. And, um, hmm. Um, There's something about um, there's something about wanting to um, okay. I need one more layer. Um, someone is wondering whether they would like to be single again. It's uh, scaring them that they have these thoughts, but these thoughts feel very pleasant of being single again. Okay, this is what I'm getting, please don't. Um, but they feel strongly they have to talk to you, because that is these thoughts of, of wanting to be single. These are, your person is kind of having, having thoughts about becoming single again. It's these, these thoughts of become, being single are very warm, very, they, they make them very, <laughs> very happy. But at the same time, the fact that they, they are thinking about, um, becoming single and they the fact that they feel very comfortable about these 
around these thoughts makes them just absolutely terrified because they understand that it has implication to your relationship. They want to desperately communicate. The inner conflict, the battle, the inner battle here. They want to talk to you. They want to communicate what's going on inside them. I am getting strongly um, this message that your person is 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 thinking what it would be like to be single again. It's very appealing to them and it's very appealing with the nine of pentacles but it's just also making them feel conflicted inside with the five of wands and then the nine of swords they can't sleep at night and they want to talk this justice here um tells me they really want to sort it out in a fair way remember at the very start when i was showing you the four of swords and pointing out to the depiction of the uh, um, with the knight sort of imagining him or herself springing into action on a horse this to me is an extension of this message this pe your person wants to talk about what's going on in their head there is something that's making them feel oh gosh I wish I was single all right, we are, if you've ever been in a relationship and you ever had some sort of conflict and this wasn't maybe sorted, um, you had these, oh gosh, I wish I was single, but they want to talk, this is clear, they want to do it the right way. And with the Knight of Wands, they really want to do something about it. Wands are, remember, about actions. So your person wants to come, talk, communicate, clearly. And with the Knight, and, uh, with the knight of Wands, they want to do something about it. In a fair way. Okay, so I... I have a feeling they've got a lot uh, to get out of their chest. Um, this is never. We've got Queen of Cups flipping. Do we see anything here? Mm hmm. Please, Tara, please, universe. Um, why Sagittarius person? We get the strength. Um, what, what's happening? Please, uh, what what will be? What are Sagittarius person actions? What will be their actions? What are their intentions? How are they going to go about um, expressing these uh, confusing thoughts or these thoughts of perhaps becoming single, going solo? why or how are they going to go about what are they going to tell my Sagittarius how are they going to deal with this inner conflict that I feel and the, the fear of just having these thoughts that are very warm and fuzzy for them of just going so again how how will I how will this person sort it out? What will they say? What will they do? How will they go about that? Um, this conflict, that inner conflict, and this... Why are they feeling this way? Sagittarius. How is this person going to deal with this? What are they going to do? I didn't see this... Um, almost flipped but it didn't and I didn't see the card so I'm not taking it okay the hanged man and a seven of pentacles okay um Saji your person is going within I feel they they have feelings, they still love you, they still have feelings. 
but I have a feeling that they will take some time to see whatever's making them have these thoughts of going solo um, to look at the situation properly, the Five of Wands being the conflict, inner conflict or the conflict between you is something that isn't um, yet resolved. It's in their energy. It will be in their energy. Um, they are going to... Your person's not giving up, I feel, with this um, strength card. And they are tapping into the emotions that they have for you with this Queen of Cups. With this strength, I feel they will be drawing on that these energies of um, perseverance wanting to resolve this in this right way remember i said that your person wants to come forward and just spell it out just say what's going on in their head so we've got eight of wands and the justice which i understand that's them saying i want to talk and i want to resolve this conflict and i'll put a lot of energy into it um this is And they will put not only a lot of energy but also a lot of thought. This is with the hangman. They, 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 they. The first energy that they come here with is exactly the same. They start light, thinking about what's going on in their head, in their heart. Remember, but they will. They understand that there has to be more. There has to be more mental work that they have to put in. They have strength, and I feel it all comes uh, from the, the the love that they have for you. But they understand that there is a um, there is an inner thought. There is something that, and they are prepared to work on whatever this is, and they will draw on the emotions that they have for you. They will draw on their inner strength that they have as an individual. Um, eh, Saji, you might be dealing with Leo, you might be dealing with... There is a lot of wands and air sign. Mm, not air sign, yeah, air sign. Fire sign, Leo, Leo Libra, water signs too. But I feel the main message here is there is a conflict they're very worried about. They had thoughts about going solo. These thoughts were very, very comfortable for them, made them very, <laughs> they see themselves like, oh gosh. Um, but then they realize that's not the way this has to be sorted out. They are drawing on love and strength. And passion for you um, and they will put that necessary um, mental work in trying to sort it out and both these energies hanged man and seven of Pentacles talk about um, having the energy coming from the space of okay we will take time seven of pentacles that's the patient person waiting for the results and look this person is nurturing the the right part of the plant the roots this is one very important message your person understands that you know the connection is worth um work and that work has to be put in in order to sort that out they are prepared to do it and they are uh, uh, they're going about it in the right way again because they are going to put energy they'll come from they'll go back and they'll go back to times when they will feel well 
why, why did we get together in first place? Okay, they'll go back to the roots and they'll draw on that energy and draw on that love in order to to have the strength to, to, to sort it out. There's some sort of conflict it makes them it makes them worry, absolutely worry with the nine of swords. Um, okay, potential outcome. <laughs> potential outcome and I cannot decide what you know what I actually okay potential outcome please there are what will be uh Oh, it's what's what's gonna happen here? What's the potential outcome for Sagittarius and their person? There's something going on, and Sagittarius person wants to talk. How? What's the potential outcome, please? Please tell. Magpies are singing. Three of Cups, Two of Swords, Ten of Wands, and Magician. Um, it's not going to be easy, it's going to weigh on your person and maybe on you too, with the nut ten of wands. I also feel that this situation, um, the magician is the creator one of you or both or your person has the energy to and with the strength i feel it's your person um there is gonna be We've got a couple. Initially, it will feel as if you sorted it out like this. Um, your person, though, will feel with the three of cups initially it will feel oh yeah okay yeah yeah we so we sorted it out um but it's not gonna go the way your your person would want um and it will make them feel you know that someone will feel um, like i don't want to deal with it anymore yes there's this superficial feeling here of yeah initially yeah everything's fine um, but it's not fine it's not gonna be fine um, with the magician though I think your person your person has an upper hand in this situation, I feel. Um, and either, either they will compromise, whatever this is, Sagittarius, The three of, three of Cups, Two of Swords, and Ten of Wands. I see it as initially it will feel as if you sorted it out for your person, from your person's perspective. These are the. F um, they feel that you guys are just the right match. We've got a couple here, Queen and King. 
of Cups. This, I pulled that to just clarify what is the Three of Cups. And so, Three of Cups being the, 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 the energy that talks about celebration, I thought to myself, yeah, your person will feel, okay, because we are a match, yeah, we, we, we yeah, sorted it out. Um, but then there is this, I'm not sure, the Two of Swords is, is this momentum when we go, I actually don't want to deal about it, this is so heavy, right, the Ten of Wands, this is heavy, um, let's just swap it under the rug, but then this energy tells me that your person won't swap it under the rug, and, and if there is a compromise that is needed, and perhaps that compromise needed on your person's side, it, it will happen. Or if this compromise has to come from your side, it will happen. And in other words, there is an energy of a creator, of, of someone who's got all um, skills, everything that's needed to sort this out. And I can see here energies of patience, patience and um, your person is willing to to put the work and with the strength draw on the love that's initially connected you to um, and to me, this is this is basically this talks about the outcome, right? Um, yeah, there is some sort of conflict here. There's something that worries your person. But with the magician, I feel it will be sorted out. There's some sort of compromise that's needed. Okay, I would like one oracle, please, for my Sagittarius. One, there you go. I've got one. This is Sacred Destiny Oracle, and that is life coaching. And I saw this. I want this for you. Okay, let's see. Um, we have love. Okay, beautiful. Um, when this card shows up, that means love is in love is present in your life. It's there. You don't need to have any doubts. And I feel with these two, um, King and Queen of Cups. I'm going to make the effort and I'm going to read it because I feel I'd like to. Here it is. Love is all around you. Love is coming into your life. You are already more cherished than you can possibly know. Indeed, you are a sacred vessel for the love, for, for, for love, excuse me, to follow through you, you when you stand in the center of it all. All is well, no matter what is happening around you. You know that you are loved and you are lovable. You know that there is nothing that you need to do to deserve love. You are enough just as you are. I wanted to read to make sure that um, when you came across come across this reading and you will watch that from the beginning, I feel that no, no matter what's happening here with you and your person, the, the, the conflict that's worrying them. Um, 
this and this tells me that um, your person is coming from the the coming here remembering the love and coming here saying I will nurture the most important part of us which is all the values which is honesty, respect, trust because this is how you build stable relationship and your person knows that and they have strength they come here and say I will put work I have enormous amount of reservoir of strength I will put in the work and I understand I need to see something from a different perspective in order to compromise and execute it and make it happen with the magician power struggle <laughs> um, there is a power struggle okay well perhaps this is what um, we see here with this um, five of wands you may be involved in a power struggle between two or more people well if this is power struggle between you and your person or your person between yeah your person and you Sagittarius um, withdraw the energy and seek balanced compromise Sagittarius, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this reading, please give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment, um, subscribe to my channel, or consider subscribing to my channel. Um, stay safe and goodbye for now.